Hello everyone, this is Shalu Kumar again from Oski Nurse Training Cambridge and an experienced Oski Nurse Trainer for the NMC Oski Exam in UK and also the Lead Trainer for Oski Nurse Training Cambridge. Uh, so I am back with another uh, Delta NMC Oski stations for you for your exam. So if you like my videos, please press the like button now and subscribe to my channel. And uh, uh, you know i will it just gives me a lot of positivity to keep making more videos for you and hopefully looking at your comments it looks like these videos are helping you so we're going to go into another topic today and i am going to cover one of the evidence-based practice stations again and we're going to talk about cranberry juice and utis okay so that's what we're going to look at cranberry juice and urinary tract infection we're going to look at what is the current evidence what is the research what does research say is it good uh, you know in uh, treating or preventing utis UTIs or not so that's what we're going to look at today I have already done a lot of evidence-based practice topics already so they are under the playlist API in my YouTube uh, channel so you can go ahead and watch those if you haven't watched them already so in today's topic I'm going to show you a scenario and also we're going to work out the answer together so let's get started so uh, you know evidence-based practice is your 10 minute station is a written station you will be given a scenario then you will be given a little research study to read and then you need to write your recommendations in bullet points that's what you need to do so let's look at the scenario for this topic here so you are nurse working in outpatient urology clinic one of your patients miss Sonia Joan so this is not belong to a real person I've just made this scenario completely for teaching purpose okay so one of your patient miss Sonia Joan is attending the clinic due to history of recurrent urinary tract infections she has heard that drinking cranberry juice uh, can be uh, beneficial for urinary tract infections and she asks you if you will recommend this okay so we're going to then they're going to sh uh, show you on the next screen I'm showing you that they're going to give you a, a search article to read and on the next screen after that you will have a blank page to write your bullet points your recommendation to the patient so that's what we're going to do so okay so you know that you got the blank page you have done that and I have shown you that I have found this research study online and I have highlighted as you can see some of the main points in there so now so we are going to write our answers uh, in bullet points so you may get this study you may get a different one in your exam I can't guarantee you it will be this one but you, you the, the evidence is the same isn't it the research is the same so we our answers should be the same so we're going to look at that answers now so what does the research says about cranberry juice and UTIs so the first thing is I will write in my answers that uh, I have uh, read this article and I write my recommendations to uh, uh, Miss Sonia Jones as below okay so the first point I will write is I will explain to Sonia that there is some research that shows that cranberry juice may prevent a UTI occurring in healthy individuals okay uh, if drunk regularly uh, so that's what research says at the moment that there is some evidence that it can actually prevent a UTI by in healthy people okay uh, if drunk regularly second thing is I will second point is I will inform Sonia that cranberry juice may be less likely to induce nausea uh, than other sugary drinks uh, when taken regularly because we know sugary drinks can cause nausea so if somebody is going to drink uh, a juice they like drinking juice it's better to drink cranberry juice because it causes less nausea so I will inform Sonia that cranberry juice may be less likely to induce nausea than other sugary drinks when taken regularly uh, number three I will inform Sonia that there is no evidence available that cranberry juice may prevent UTI in individuals who have high risk conditions uh, or those with indwelling catheters as people in these uh, groups were not included in the study okay so the only the healthy people were included in the study uh, people with underlying health conditions were not included in the study so that's what this point is about so I will inform Sonia that there is no evidence available that cranberry juice may prevent UTI in individuals who have high risk conditions or those with indwelling catheters as people in these groups were not included in the study. Uh, number four, I will explain to Sonia that there is no evidence available which suggests 
that cranberry juice can be used as a treatment okay it cannot treat utis okay it may be able to prevent a uti in healthy people only but it cannot treat a uti so that's what the current research says so i will explain to sonia that there is no evidence available which suggests that cranberry juice can be used to treat a uti in place of antibiotics uh, number five now this is very interesting point because the this series uh, this study was funded by um, leading cranberry juice manufacturer so you know we have to think how reliable the results are okay so i will inform sonia that it is necessary to note that the research was funded by a leading cranberry juice manufacturer indicating a potential conflict of interest uh, so that's that's the main things in this uh, in this uh, topic um, so that's how you will write your answers okay those are the five main points you need to write in your answers so i hope you like uh, this video and i hope it makes it clearer for you so the basic idea is what we have learned is that cranberry juice maybe there is some evidence that it can prevent utis uh, in healthy people only we don't know if you can prevent in people who have long-term conditions underlying conditions why because they never included these people in the study only people included in the study were the healthy people okay and the other thing to think about is it cannot treat utis it can only only used as a prevention you need antibiotics for uh, treatment of uh, utis and the other thing to think is the study was funded by a man, um, manufacturing company of cambridge juice so there is there there is their conflict of interest isn't it so we're not sure if we if these results are very reliable okay so that was the main themes in this topic so i've shown you the answers on there i hope you like this video and if you do like it please don't forget to press the like button and subscribe to my channel i will soon be back with another nmc adult nmc oski topic for you and if you need uh, if you need further information about our training uh, please email us on oski nurse training at outlook.com and you can also visit our website on oski nurse training dot um, com and also you can check our reviews what people been saying what our fellow nurses who have passed the exam been saying about our training on our google ad page okay so you can check it out for yourself okay and i will see you very soon bye for now